Miss Alessandra here from the Weston Public Library bringing you Imagine That Science. So if you've signed up for our Summer Library Adventures program, you would have gotten a uh, science card letting you know how to do our science experiment for this week. If not, I'm going to walk you through it. And if you'd like to sign up for our Summer Library Adventures, just go to westonpubliclibrary.org to our Children or Teen Summer Library Adventures page. Um, for this experiment, we are going to be doing something that goes along with this week's theme. So our theme for week number three of our Summer Library Adventures program is Fairy Tales, Myths, Rhymes, and Songs. So we are going to do a Jack and the Beanstalk experiment, um, planting a bean in a bag. So that's what we're doing today, and if you want to join us, you're only going to need a couple of things. So I'm going to go over that now. For this uh, experiment, you're going to need a Ziploc bag. I'm using a sandwich bag, but you can use a quart or a gallon size if you have one. You're going to need a paper towel, a little bit of water, and some type of bean seeds. So I have three different ones here. I have a, a lima bean, I have a bush bean, and I have a green bean. So you can have any type of bean seeds, and if you're using a sandwich bag, you only need one. If you're using a bigger one, you'll need two to four seeds. Um, and we're gonna go through how to grow a bean in a bag in our Jack and the Beanstalk experiment. So for our experiment, the first thing that you're gonna do is open up your Ziploc bag. And then you're going to take your paper towel, so here's my paper towel, and you're gonna fold it in half. You might have to fold it a little more um, to fit inside your bag. So I'm just trying to make it fit inside my sandwich bag. So I'm gonna do it um, a little bit on the side here. And I'm going to open my bag back up, put my paper towel inside the bag. Make sure that it would be able to close, which it will. All right, and that's our first step. So it's laying flat in the bag. The next step is that we want our paper towel to become damp in the bag. So I suggest putting the paper towel in before you get it wet because it's very hard to get it flat inside the bag when it's already wet. So get it in when it's dry and then add a little bit of water. So I just add a little bit of water to the top, right across. I want the whole thing to become damp. So I'm just seeing, you can see it's becoming wet. I might have to do a little bit more water because the bottom's still a little dry. So I'm gonna add in just a little more water. You can see what I'm doing. So I've made it pretty, pretty damp here. Okay, you don't want any excess water. So it's not filled with water. Don't fill the bag with water. But you do want it damp. If you have any excess water, I have a little bit. I'm going to just um, pour that out. Okay, and there we go. The next step is to take your bean seed, whatever bean seed you have, and you're going to put it on top, not inside, but on top of your, and I'm going to just put all three in here, but um, they're all different bean, seed, uh, bean seeds, but I'm going to put them all in here so you can see. So I'm just laying them flat. Then I'm going to push out as much air as possible. Okay, you don't want any air in, and I'm going to seal it. Okay, so you can see they stay in the places that I put them. If you are using more than um, one bean seed, you want to spread them out um, so that they have room to grow. So this is the experiment. We've put our bean seeds in the bag. Now they should be able to grow if you put them on a counter getting a little bit of sun the seeds should be able to start growing in the bag and you won't have to add water because we've dampened this paper towel. 
um, you'll see condensation inside the bag which allows for you to not have to add water in the beginning stages of the bean growing. Once you start seeing the sprouts coming up towards the top um, or the roots, depending on the type of bean seed it is, um, growing downwards, you can decide if you'd like to transplant this into a garden, but they should be able to start growing in this bag. That's the experiment. And what you're gonna wanna do is take the bag Put it on the counter um, where it could get a little bit of sun. Do not open the bag. Even when it starts to grow a little bit, don't open the bag until you're ready to transplant it. You'll see that the bean will start growing in the bag because of the condensation from the wet paper towel. Um, and then you can choose a spot outside where you can um, transplant into a garden. And that's when you'll open it and safely remove the plant that's growing in the bag and put it into um, your garden. So that is the experiment and um, hopefully you're able to do this. I would love to see any of your seeds grown. Um, so if you can take a picture as they're growing, but in the next few days, I will probably see my beans start growing in the bag and you'd see the same thing. So I hope you have fun with this. This is our Jack and the Beanstalk Bean in a Bag experiment, and I hope you're able to get some bean sprouts from this. Thanks for watching. See you next time.